boys of class 7 welcome you to the online class of agriculture i am ubhijit sir last class we have started revising from chapter 4 and we have finished lesson 1 and 2 from the topic agriculture and climate today i will give a class on lesson 3 and 4 from chapter 4 so let's start today's session by Last class we have known about what is rubic cups and aspect of rubic season. So let us learn about what is kharif crops and aspect of kharif season. Crops that spend total or most of kharif season for its physical growth, flower blossom and fructification is known as kharif crops. That is uh, crops which spend the it's time for sowing to fruit reaping in Kharif season that is known as Kharif crops. Aspects of Kharif season is very important for crops production. These aspects are, this is totally opposite from Ravi, Ravi season's aspect because that was winter season. Now it is mix of, we know the time scale schedule between uh, uh, time schedule of Kharif is summer and rainy season so first of all it is high temperature then heavy rainfall occurs in this season A relatively high humidity he in this season storm possibilities is much because uh, for summer the air becomes so dry and it makes some air pressure and that is why some storms happening in this season also fear of hailstorm this season threat of flood because heavy rainfall occurs during this season disease and pest attack is much and do a lot of hazards to the crops irrigation is unnecessary because in this season there is so much rainfall and daytime is more or equal to night time so compared to Arabic season aspects that is totally opposite now let us know about briefly Kharif season Kharif season is divided into two phases and the time duration between Chaitra to Bhadra and this total time is divided into two phases one is Kharif 1 and another one is Kharif 2 so let us know about Kharif 1 first the time duration between Chaitra to Jaishto is known about Kharif 1 and this time it is actually uh, a high temperature that means hot season rain is moderate and shower that means uh, heavy rainfall starts at the end of this season during this season for hot weather threat of nor'westers and hailstorms occur sometimes there is sudden river swelling floods in many areas uh, which is vulnerable for for that area in this season people experience high temperature at, as it is the hot uh, hot season and moderate humidity because sometimes there is rain and sometimes it's not but humidity is moderate in medium scale disease and pest attack at, uh, occurs Sometimes moderate irrigation is needed also. Crops which are very mentionable in this season are jute, sisham, amaranth, okra, snakegut, bittergut, pumpkin, etc. But in this season, there is very important fruits for B Bengalis like mango, jackfruit, blackberry, watermelon 
are available. Now let us know about Kharif 2. The time duration between Ashar to Bhadru is known about Kharif 2 and here it is in our Bengali season it is basically rainy season so so much rainfall it should be so amount of rainfall is much and less threat of gust and hailstorm in this season because uh, there is not that much uh, air pressure due to heavy rainfall flood is certain and it is alarming for people and as there is so much heavy rainfall so there is no need of irrigation excessive heat prevails through the season and the air contains humidity disease and pest attack is much than Kharif 1 mentionable crops of this season are almond, rice, aquatic sprout, ash guard, reef guard, sponge etc and fruits like palm, amaloki, pineapple, hop plum, guava, pomelo are mentionable of this season. So that was about total kharif which is divided into two phases and you can easily understand that it is mixture of hot and rainy season, like the summer and rainy season of Bangla but in agricultural season it is known as kharif season and fruits, crops those are very mentionable for the Kharif. These crops are grow in this season because they need hot and sometimes rainy weather and uh, humidity in air. Now boys, let us know about another thing that is not Actually, if the total season is divided into two agriculture season that is uh, Ravi, Ravi season and Kharif season but crops sometimes don't need to depend on this season and that is about neutral crops season neutral crops so let us know about season neutral crops crops which are not depend on any season like Ravi or Kharif and especially that don't depend on their night time length can be cultivated throughout the year known as season neutral crops and mentionable crops of this season basically throughout the season which crops found are available in our country are known as season neutral crops like red amaranth, eggplants, papaya, chili banana maize groundnut etc so these are about season neutral crops and for season neutral crops there should be some specific characteristics and the characteristics are they can be grown in both low and high temperature if any crops is capable of growing in any temperature like if there is low or high it doesn't depend on that temperature then it can be season neutral crops another thing it can grow in both less rain and heavy rain that means if it is not rain or if it is more much rain then also it can grow then it should be season neutral crops it can grow both in low and high humidity that means it's not depends on humidity also and another thing that is whatever the day length or night length it doesn't depend on that time so this is the main characteristics of season neutral crops so boys here we are about agricultural season we have known about two season of our country agricultural season one is Rabi another one is Kharif and there are some crops which is available throughout the whole year that is known about season neutral crops so I think this should be very helpful for you don't forget to submit the assignments in due time when it is when it should be given to you now today after this 
go through the lectures and books and it should be very helpful for you if there is any problem let me know in comment section so today is bye from me